Okay, Satanism, Nazis, and racists. Let me try to break this down to you as best as I can. Um, one, there is no real correlation between Satanists, Nazis, and racists. Okay, there are people in all three categories that try to make correlations between three categories. That does not mean there really is one. Most Satanists, including myself, think that merit stands on its own two feet, regardless of your race, regardless of your genetic connection, regardless of if you're a, you know, considered a Jew, an Aryan, a Mexican, a Negro, an Asian, whatever. Uh, most Satanists think that merit stands on its own two feet and judges people on an individual level. All right. The Nazis, now granted, we're talking about a 70 year old political, you know, um, philosophy because that time it was a philosophy. They were looking for anything and they were desperate to find anything on a scientific level to promote their propaganda about race and about the Aryan root is what they like to call it. Now, Hitler and Heimler spent millions of millions of dollars sending German archaeologists all across the world to Tibet, to South America, to Africa, to parts of Europe, even into America, um, you know, disguised on archaeological expeditions because Hitler believed largely because he was insane and he was on high doses of methamphetamine, which is now called meth or speed, which he gave out um, freely to his army, especially the, the upper elite, the Third Reich, and also the um, Japanese army when they got into cahoots because they found that, well, it's a great antidepressant and you can fight for days and not give a fuck. Anyway, Hitler was fucking insane. He relied largely on mystics and uh, drug psychosis to come up with a lot of his theories of race and world domination. Don't get me wrong, I've done some stupid shit when I was high too, but <laughs> this was a guy that was in a position to possibly dominate the world and he was a extensive drug addict and he relied heavily on occultists. Prophets, um, yeah, tarot card readers, astrologers to tell him when was right time to strike and what was going on. So Hitler was crazy. We all know this. And the people directly under him were under his influence and uh, for the most part likely is crazy. Anyway, he basically he spent millions of dollars, hundreds of millions, sending real scientists which he inducted into the Third Reich, which a lot of them were killed as war criminals afterwards, which sucks because they weren't Nazis, they were scientists and they didn't have a choice. It was like work for me or die. What are you gonna do? Work for me or die. This is what I want you to find. So of course it worked for him. But anyway, they spent they spent ten years scavenging the world. Uh, Egypt, Tibet, South Africa, Africa, South America, America, Northern European countries and to try to find a what he called a Aryan route to promote his propaganda. He wanted he, Hitler's views were that there was an Aryan root that was once the dominant race in this world who created the lost city of Atlantis and who got extinct when that city fell but whose bloodlines are scattered throughout the world because they dominated the world and it later got tied into UFOs and like alien technology but that would be way too long of a video to go into that part but anyway there is no real tie to Nazis and Satanism. Some racists and some Nazis, if they're even such a thing anymore, um, do try to identify themselves with Satanist. But at that time, they tried to identify themselves with anybody. They tried to identify themselves with Catholics. They tried to make friends with the Pope, and they did. And a lot of those SS high officials escaped because of the Catholic Church willing to re-identify them and give them passports. So they were looking to identify themselves with anybody that would help them. 
and support the propaganda. And Satanists have never been there for that. The majority of Satanists largely look at people on a non-racial level, on a level of merit stands on its own two feet. We judge people on their personal abilities, their personal um, accomplishments, their personal um, the personality, period, you know, uh, regardless of their race. And uh, for those of you that call me a racist, fuck you guys. You know, I know that I, I have Northern European features and I can easily identify with some of these satanic organizations that call them, you know, that have racial ties and Nazi ties, but I will never do that. I will never do that because I'm not a Nazi and I'm not a racist and, you know, Granted, the Third Reich and the Nazis did have some scientific contributions. The majority of it was bullshit. The majority of it was propaganda. And uh, you got to remember, these these were guys high on power and high on fucking meth, running across the country, murdering people on a mass level. And I will never support that ever, ever support that. So, as far as Satanism ties into Nazism and or Nazis and racism and whatever. It's mostly bullshit. It's mostly bullshit. It's people grasping at straws to try to find current um, current trends to identify with to support their propaganda. It's bullshit. And it always has been, and uh, and I'm, hopefully it always will.